So what I like thinking about is like, what are the least sexy businesses? Those are always the best businesses. Now, mm. like a consumer facing, like for us, because we're consumer facing, we got this like purplish brand. It feels sexy. It's not at all sexy when you're operating it. That's why I think it's a great business. Yeah. Right? If any, if a, like I usually think that if a business is sexy, there's something wrong with it. Like for example, there's this company, and the they, they're doing really well. I won't say the name exactly, but they work with like cattle trading. Yeah. Uh, In like really rural India, it's a software company, like software that like helps facilitate cattle trading, and they are huge. Like they're growing insanely fast. They have like like one crore downloads. Uh, or like for example, another really like boring business. This is why come into business called Ironclad, right? yeah, which is yeah. essentially like not in India, but it's a it's a software business that, yeah. uh, in in I think it's in Seattle. Yeah. Right? They just do like contract software, like software to help lawyers pass through contracts better, and it's massive. It's yeah. massive. Like the business is huge. So the way I look at it is that ideas like that, like uh, software that facilitates cattle trading, not something that's on the surface, not something that's immediately like visible. Those are the opportunities that I'm always usually excited by.